Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's a very quick short video for those people who are asking me uh, lifting weights uh, for my videos. So what kind of weights I should be lifting? Right, I'm going to be talking to you guys. Um, um, there are three uh, different weights that you can use, three different types of um, equipments that you can use for this barbell uh, pump workout, or body pump or body power. And also I will be giving you option for those three types of people that um, always ask me that what kind of weight you're lifting and what kind of weight I should be lifting. Right, so let's talk about the first thing. The workout that videos that I do, they are strength workouts at high reps and a light weight. So that means you will be working out with a lot of repetition in your workout. So we suggest that, obviously, I personally suggest that you take light barbell, light plate or light dumbbells for each individual tracks and has a different kind of um, weight selection. Okay, so the first thing I'm talking about, there are three types of people and I'm talking it from my own experience. Okay, three types of people in my class. I have complete beginners who they never ever have done any workout Beginners that have done workout, however, never done a body pump or body power type of workout or strength barbell workout. Number three are regulars, then they have done always this kind of workout. By end of this video, I will obviously give you the weight selections for each individual types of uh, participants so that you will know exactly what you uh, can take. However, there are no rules. You don't have to lift what somebody else lift or what somebody suggests it's just just an idea and suggestions for yourself okay now if i'm talking about three types of weights also or the equipments okay three types of equipment now if i talk about three types of equipments number one is a complete barbell set so you will put plates clips with it and make your barbell the way you want to be for each track Second thing, you can use just plates for entire workout, okay? And the third one that you can use dumbbells, okay? Now, this particular type of workout, I suggest that if you are using dumbbells only or plates only, then you reduce your weight lower. As is individual weights in each hand, it will be lot harder if you try to match the dumbbells weight with your barbell for example if your barbell weight is 25 kilograms for back squat if you take two dumbbells as a 25 kilograms you will not be able to do the same workout with dumbbells and barbells matching the same weight right so remember that and so here in this video you'll find out that what you can do or what you what you can take for um, uh, each individual tracks and what kind of weights uh, 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 you can take. Okay, now talking about the first type of people, which are complete beginners. When you're complete beginners, I suggest that at least a minimum up to six weeks, you stay with a similar weight as you start until you master the technique and the tempo in the workout, um, as well as getting used to with, with this kind of workout. After six weeks, you start to gradually increase your weights. You will feel more comfortable and you will feel absolutely amazing throughout these changes, okay? Remember, take your time. Now talking about second type of people who they have done perhaps CrossFit, um, or um, a, a heavy lifting in the in the gym or been doing a lot of athletic workouts yes they are fit however they are new to this kind of workouts a high reps so that means their muscles not used to having for example 130 reps on a squat track they're probably not used to with it and therefore it will be very difficult for those kind of people to maintain the whole an hour workout with the high weight on the bar okay take your time perhaps you don't need to take your time as a complete beginners 
but if you can consider yourself up to two to three weeks a similar weight not extremely light not heavy perhaps fit in somewhere that you feel a little comfortable to start with yes it is it is something sometimes you might think that okay no i've done loads of lifting if you have done loads of lifting perhaps you're lifting in the gym that one barbell has 100 kilograms and you did one deadlift where this kind of workout you will have about 15 kilograms and you will be doing probably about 30 deadlifts just an example and therefore your muscle needs to get used to and understand the way of doing high reps and lightweight workout right and then we're talking about the regulars regulars of course they if they've been doing workout for um, three months four months six months we start to count them as a regulars regulars will have an idea of what kind of weights giving them the challenge what kind of weights they're feeling comfortable and they kind of like in a zone where they can actually choose their own um, weight selection okay when i say that take one third off for this barbell take add some weight more or, or just go medium weight this is just a basic suggestion and it don't have to be the same as i mentioned earlier there are no rules so talking about now for the beginners and then the second beginners which uh, they have done other workout but need to pump and the regulars okay so let's give you the ideas of lifting weight let's go let's give you an idea of the weight selection we are talking about the warm-up track first of all the warm-up track where beginners we suggest to go for light as well as the need to pump and also regulars warm-up it's not countable the reason behind it because you need to make sure that your body gets warm you increase your heart rate so do whatever it takes you obviously not going to lifting the weights that you're going to do workout the reason behind i suggest to go for lightweight on warm-up is so that your heart rate goes up and also your muscles are slowly getting ready for the workout you become flexible and you mobilize your joints and therefore it's very very important that you are not lifting heavy and also there would be risk of injuries if you start to lift heavy from the warm-up after the warm-up we're moving to uh, the next track so triceps triceps is a small muscle which is back of your arm for the small muscle i suggest that you take a warm-up weight you keep your warm-up weights on the barbell as well as your biceps for all participants so you can play with your weight first three four weeks to see what is your warm-up weight once you know your warm-up weight then you know this warm-up weight you can keep for your arms workout because your arms small it's a small muscle group on your arms workout you can use a barbell same as your warm-up you can use two single plates or two single dumbbells now again same level okay then i'm moving to the next workout which would be squat so that's the heaviest track the now heaviest track means the heaviest weight on the bar okay are you ready for it okay now this is when your workout starts for the beginners my suggestion is little bit more than warm-up weight so if you have for example of two total weight in your warm-up five kilograms on barbell then i would say you can take seven eight kilograms or perhaps if you want to if you feel really ready for it then you can go for 10 kilograms so that means double your warm-up weight okay people that have never done pump before type 2 people but they are fit and they have done fitness before I still suggest that you probably can double your warm-up weight so remember type 1 people can be a little bit less than double so more than warm-up between more than warm-up to double type 2 people up to 
the double weight or maybe slightly more or double i would suggest third type of people regulars i suggest that definitely try out more than double okay so if you have 10 kilos on your barbell as a doing your warm up then you would go for 20 kilos plus right okay so the next track we are doing um, is our back track back track working with legs and arms so you are integrating when you integrate you obviously can go heavy however not heavy as a squat the reason behind it you will require to press your barbell above your head so if your barbell is 30 kilograms and doing clean and press with the 30 kilo on your bar this is going to be extremely hard because we're looking at quite a few reps in here and so the suggestions for type 1 people is to keep your uh, warm-up weight on barbell or uh, slightly more okay type 2 people is a warm-up weight or slightly more okay type 3 the regulars you will go double your warm-up weight okay double your warm-up weight that means less than your squat more than your warm-up in my view that would be a medium weight for you chest workout guys chest workout is upper body so you literally not working your legs obviously leg muscles are big and a chest muscle is not big as legs and so my suggestion to those who are complete beginners just go back to the warm-up weight on bar which could be a five kilos in total or or eight kilos so go back to warm-up weight until you get used to with your movement okay and type two people i would suggest warm-up or slightly more than warm-up okay regulars yes of course try to go a more than warm-up weight and if you are actually lifting the barbell that you less than your warm-up that means you need to check your warm-up weights probably be too high so reduce your warm-up weight so that you can match your chest workout okay so you're not going to go heavier on warm-up than your chest okay so lightweight however slightly more than warm-up for regulars now the next one after that is lunges lunges is working your front of your leg back of your leg and glutes so quad hamstring glutes and you are obviously working lower body and so here are the options if you are lifting a bar putting on your back okay because you're working individual legs or i mean my suggestion is to those who have never done pump before the beginners i would suggest that try out first few sessions with just body weight to understand that when you're going down that what's the pressure how it's building okay type two who are fit and done lots of workout but never done this kind of body pump workout I would suggest you can take light barbell so something like warm-up weight or a single plate or single dumbbell light so if your warm-up was 10 kilos two fives then I would say take it similar weight or slightly less okay and the regulars of course the barbell okay back into warm-up weight Okay, or you can add a little bit more, slightly more, if you're doing the lunges, keeping barbell on your back, okay? And obviously this way you can also have option to either bar or the plate, okay? So hold a plate at the front, so that would be a front holding lunge, or you can hold plate or even dumbbell on the side so that will be at lunges without lifting your arms so you can obviously understand the difference between um, two hand weights and a barbell because you're working individual legs don't forget okay right so 
the next one oh, I'm talking about shoulders shoulders are has a lot of shoulder joints and therefore my suggestion is to not to go too heavy for shoulder workout again it depends on people's strength okay I personally feel very comfortable lifting a heavier weight on shoulders than chest However, some people could be other way around. They might feel more comfortable lifting weight on um, uh, for chest than shoulders or shoulders than chest. It all depends on in each individual. Okay, so talking about the shoulders workout, we're engaging our side of the arms, which is the deltoid, as well as the shoulder blades at the back, so upper back, so the, the rear deltoid, okay? For this kind of workout, you obviously can keep your barbell weight same as your chest weight. Now, some people drop it down. However, I increase a little bit more because I can feel that I have got more strength on my shoulder than chest. Ideally, it's the similar weight, okay? And always remember that you need to make sure that your posture is correct on each individual move on your shoulders and then you will be able to lift a little bit heavier. So if your shoulders forward, it's very difficult. Shoulders back, your posture is nice and strong, you will be able to engage your core, you'll be able to engage the right muscle and you'll be able to lift heavier. So beginners, your warm-up weights, okay? Second type of people that need to this kind of workout, Perhaps the warm up or slightly more, a regular warm up or slightly more. Okay, so these are the weights for your shoulders. Uh, I've covered everything, guys, and this is it from me. I hope this video was useful. Please message me or comment in this video to let me know what you think. Um, yeah, and absolutely good luck to all type of people. Uh, enjoy your workout. Thank you so much for watching this video. Bye for now.